Hello, Ark from Wikimedia here, and today I'm going to show you how to install the Millionaire mod, which is a really cool mod that, uh, as you explore your world, it will generate NPC villages in those villages, or it won't start out as a village. It'll start out as a group of NPCs, which will slowly build their, um, town. There's a few different types of villagers, um, there's a farmer, uh, wood cutter, something else, um, and you can trade with them and they will upgrade their, um, towns and villages and you can also, uh, and build extra buildings and you can design your own extra buildings and download other people's, which is really, really cool. So, let's get started. First, you're going to want to look in the description of this video, so click right down below, and then you're going to get a link to a page similar to this, could be a, um, a newer update of the mod, um, and what this is is an all-in-one zip file um, with mod loader and, and the millionaire mod, so you're going to want to download this, and you're going to get the zip file, and when you unzip it, you'll get this nice um, bunch of files. So it includes um, a program called WinRAR, which is um, an archiving program which allows you to open zip files, jar files, and RAR files. If you already have it, you don't need to reinstall. Um, there's two versions, 64-bit and 32-bit. Install whichever one is for your operating or version of your operating system in your computer. Um, and then there's going to be a client folder in here. And so what we're going to have to do, um, and I'll show you all these steps, is we're going to have to um, install mod loader and then put these files in um, the Minecraft folder. First you're going to want to open Minecraft. For any new mod that you're installing, um, you may, and you haven't tried before, you may want to um, uh, download a fresh jar and for this um, experience I totally recommend you do that so when you open your launcher um, go into options and then uh, click force update and it'll say will force done and then log in and so this will re-download all your um, Minecraft files it will keep your um, your save files and your texture packs the same and your uh, achievements as well so that will stay it'll just download all the core game files so there we go also if um, you want uh, HD texture pack patch it at this point um, not after installing the mod so now you can close this and we're going to want to go here into your start menu and type percent app data one word percent and then it's going to open this folder which is uh, normally hidden and you want to go to this dot minecraft folder and open that up now you're going to see all the files here i just uh, re-downloaded my whole dot minecraft folder so this is how it will be um, uh, from the start without any uh, else installed. So this is totally vanilla. So resources has your sound, file save, save, stats, texture packs, um, game options, and your bin folder which has all the uh, jar files. So you basically just re-downloaded this whole folder. But we're gonna want to mod this Minecraft jar. So we're gonna right click it, open it with WinRAR. So here you have your Minecraft f um, game, basically, the whole game. And then you're going to want to open this client folder in here and uh, open this jar with WinRAR Archiver as well. And there we go. And you're going to want to copy all these, or select all these files, and then copy, paste and then OK and uh, so they're combined now you can close this one off if you want and you need to delete this meta inf 
uh, folder. So uh, I just press delete and then enter. It'll delete that and then we can close this. So now we've installed um, mod loader and um, we can go back to this dot minecraft folder here and we're gonna want to run the game first. And um, now you'll see there's a new mod loader property, so we don't have to touch that. But there's a new um, mods folder in here. And it's empty, And um, but we don't have to open it, sorry. Um, and so in this dot minecraft folder, and in here we want to go to the put in minecraft folder. And you're going to want to take, um, oops. Actually, yeah, no, this is right. Um, you want to take all these files, copy them, and paste them in here. And yes. So here are the millionaire files, um, the config. Uh, so if you want to change any settings, you can do that. Um, if like there's a confusion with another mod, you can change this ID to something else that's already not taken. Um, and I'm just going to change that to um, 200, so maybe we can I can find one quickly for you guys. Um, and then if you go to this page, which is I'm going to link in the description, um, and you can download uh, other people's um, creations uh, or buildings. You just put them in here, um, or in one of these subfolders. There's instructions there, um, and then under the mods folder, you want this zip file. So that's all we need to do for this. And so now we can run the game again. And at this point. Um, you finished modding. And if you get this message here that uh, it's loaded, that means you've successfully installed the mod. So congratulations if you see that. Okay, so you can see the beginnings of a village over there. I found it by pressing V and then it tells me uh, what direction it is. And um, although I don't have a compass, um, I just tried all the directions and see um, which one um, the numbers or the distance goes up and which uh, for which it goes down. So here's some NPCs, which is very cool. I could do with some rest so they talk. Here I'll just lower the um, this. I normally record recruits and suits in a different program, and this program isn't made for this, so. Uh, I apologize for the lag. So let's see. This is a house. So they have houses and uh, chests. Plant and then I will harvest. So this guy's a farmer. I never checked what this one was. And so their villages start out pretty small and uh, and grow. If you want to, uh, oh, here's the town hall. So this is where you can interact with them. Um, you can sell and buy things from them. Um, so I'll wait for the trader. Actually, I don't have any items, but um, yeah. So that's about it for installing this mod and. Uh, quick quick overview um, it's very well done and it uh, definitely has some potential so see you next time on a real edition of recruits and suits and um, check out our other mod installation